I'm holding this instrument I can't play because it instantly makes me look 70% more attractive. Hey there, my name is Jonathan, and welcome to Just Eyeball It. Today is Valentine's Day, and in order to commemorate that, I am wearing a shirt covered in tears. But seriously though, I'm single this Valentine's Day, and that doesn't bother me one bit. I don't have to share the half-off chocolate with anyone, and... I get to spend that time with my friends. But I think we tend to focus too much on whether or not we have a boyfriend or girlfriend, and not enough on our other relationships. So that's why today's video is about friendships and keeping them afloat. In other words, making them the ships that never sink. I consider myself to be friends with a lot of people, some closer than others, but all of them are special in some way. Now unfortunately, the more people you become friends with, the harder it is to properly stay in touch with them and then People drift apart, and things get awkward, and chimps start to sink a little. And you might be thinking, but why don't you just talk to these people, Jonathan? Well then, I would have to acknowledge that I'm a bad friend, and I would prefer if they did this first. And so rather than acknowledge the fact that people have been terrible at keeping in touch, they will just ignore each other for another six months, a year, three years, until their birth... I got a phone call. My train of thought just got derailed. Now most of you have that someone who you really want to talk to, but you also don't want to talk to because you have mad anxiety in your little heart, and I was just thinking, what if I do it for you? Dear person, you used to be a lot closer with the one who sent you this, or maybe they wanted to be a lot closer with you, or maybe they just imagined that it would be a cool thing to be closer with you. Anyway, they would like to be closer with you, but not in that way. Well, maybe a little bit that way if you're into that. And they would just like to say, sorry for not talking to you in a while, for not inviting you to their party, and maybe even for not sending you this video personally, but rather passive-aggressively leaving it on their social media for you to find. They may even be continuing to send you unsolicited Candy Crush requests. God knows they continue to watch this guy. But despite this, they are not all to blame for this shitty, dying relationship. I'd like to remind you that you also haven't spoken to them in an insert amount of time here. So really, you're both to blame. All this to say that the person sending you this, whether passive-aggressively or not, misses your face. And although you might be very busy now, or not, they would like to be a small, but slightly less small, part of your life. Please make sure at least 50 of your friends see this in the next 24 hours. If this doesn't happen, your mom will be hit by a bus and you'll have a terrible sex life and ah, everything will be terrible forever and ah, bye! Hey there, thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed this and want to see more of my videos, be sure to press the subscribe button down there, and maybe become one of my friends. Alright, take care. Bye.